Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Baldur's Gate, Siege of Dragonspear. In the last episode, uh, we found some crusaders fighting some dro. One of the dro happened to know Viconia, and uh, we eliminated all of them. Because that's what we do. Indeed. Tempted to go back to uh, um, the potion guy and sell uh, a lot of this stuff to him. So we've got water elementals and a person named Strunk. Enjoy your freedom while it lasts. Soon you'll be mine. Hello. Forgive me if I lack the time for conversation, fellow crusader. I'm uh, in the middle of a delicate ritual. I'll talk fast. What are you up to here? I'm binding water elementals from this river. The creatures of pure water that will serve me as I do Kalar's work on the battlefield. <laughs> With their power, the crusade's success is assured. <laughs> I know something of the nature of elementals. They resent being pulled from their natural plane to be bound by magic. Which is totally why uh, Dine Air keeps doing it. <clears throat> is the ritual dangerous? To a lesser wizard, certainly, for a son of the Strunk bloodline, let me put it this way. As long as I live, these elementals stay bound to my will. And these creatures serve you, willingly or no? Willingly, unwillingly, what does it matter? Better these creatures die than Kalar's worthy servants. The needs of the lady outweigh the needs of the few. Fair enough. That is a matter of opinion. Let me share my own view on the situation with you in the form of your hor horrific demise. Yeah. You would do battle with Strunk of Silvery Moon? <laughs> well, this is a lucky happenstance. It will be an ideal test of my control over my minions. Elementals, attack! I'll recover. I like the Crusade patrols just standing by doing absolutely nothing. Well, I wasn't bad. I'll take that. <laughs> Sweetheart? Crusade Patrol's just like, eh, you know, I mean... It wasn't a friend of mine. Alright, so, let's see. That is a mage robe of cold resistance. And this is a... Dagger, probably a dagger of ice or something. Elements, fury, plus two. The mage who crafted this strange dagger was obsessed with the four elemental planes and sought to create a, a means to join them together. Opening portals to all of them at once, he managed to join their energies together to enchant this relic, giving it properties of each plane. Unfortunately, he happened to be standing between the portals holding the dagger in his hand when the energies conver converged. When the energies converged, they converged on him. It was the mage's apprentice who discovered the dagger clutched in his master's charred and frozen hands. So, let's see. 1d4 cold damage to fire elementals. 1d4 fire damage to water elementals. 1d4 acid damage to earth elementals. And 1d4 electrical damage to air elementals. Why not uh, water damage to fire elementals? Fire to the water air to the earth, and earth to the air. Oh, right, because the game doesn't uh, have that. So 1d4 plus 2, plus 1, fire, cold, electrical, or acid damage. See, fire is from the elemental plane of fire, but cold is from the para-elemental plane of ice, electrical is from the quasi-elemental plane of electricity, which is, incidentally, the merging of air and positive so it makes little sense that this would be a thing, but anyway. And acid is non-elemental at all. I mean, arguably, I suppose you could say it's from the para-elemental plane of ooze, but not really. Anyway, it's a dagger, and we don't use daggers. So, into the bag of holding it goes. Alright, move along. What is this? I came to rescue my elemental companions and find them already freed. The wizard tried to bind them to his will. I put an end to his evil. 
Thanks to me, they are. Elmandretta, freer of enslaved elementals, at your service. The wizard who bound your people offended me. I ended his life. Uh, we'll go with the first one. Your deed merits reward. This may look like an ordinary stone, but its powers are great. With it, you may remove any taint or impurity from water, no matter how befouled. I was hoping for something more like a sapphire as big as my head, but I suppose I can make do with this. A great treasure indeed. Thank you. Farewell. Know that you have a friend among the waterfolk always. Yeah, despite the fact that I've killed some of you. Gained an item, 12,000 experience points. Very nice. Where is... Ah, oh, there it is. Purification Stone. This smooth, silvery-gray stone floats in the air around its user's head, untethered by gravity or other earthly concerns. Protected, protecting its user from poison and disease. It can be used once a day to cleanse mortal bodies of unnatural contamination. Ah, so it's not just a purification stone, it's an ion stone. Grants immunity to poison and disease, neutralize poison once per day. Uh, it's, uh, I don't know. Well, you know what? I suppose she doesn't have a helmet. Uh, what is this? Non-detection. Um, actually, yeah, you know what? Wrong thing. Cloak of the Gargoyle. Yeah, physical damage resistance plus 5%. Sure, why not? I guess you can hold on to it. I mean, you can always swap out the uh, Dexterity plus 1 Ion Stone. If necessary. Mm hmm. Right. Angie. Yes? Certainly. Let's go ahead and quick save. Get out. Get out of here. That's a tall tale if ever I've heard one. Tall tale? Best not let the captain hear you talk like that. And look at the marks on the walls if you don't believe me. Hello? You need something? You again. Warm up by the fire if you like. Hello, mercenary. Come have a drink with us. I don't remember these people. God, Spence. I told you what happened the last time one of the cell swords joined us. Yeah, you told me. I still don't believe it. What happened? That was a mercenary named Ferris. You know him? No great loss if you don't. The oak dropped a vial of fire breath potion in this pot. Can't decide what's more miraculous, that it didn't kill him, or that brass beaker breaker didn't kill him when, uh, once things had calmed down we'd cleared the air. Uh, clear the air? Breathe deep, you can still smell it even now. Now we have to keep all the explosive potions sealed up in crates at the depot and hike back there if we need one. Bloody Ferris, still can't believe anyone was that stupid. Who the what now? Okay. Your need, whatever you like. Well, let's uh, south. All right, well, let's not do that just yet. Let's see what we got up here. Okay, so here we've got some doors. All right, so I definitely am getting the feeling that this area down here is not strictly connected. It is done. So let's head down here first. I think this is going to be more like a side questy area. That's my hope, at least. Do do do. Just watch everyone move. Um. Uh. Dina Air. Of course, I get there first. I win. I win. Safana comes in second. Who's going to be third? It's definitely not going to be Dina Air. Do 
Looks like Corwin is coming in third. And who is the first of the loser brigade? Minsk. And then Vaconia. And of course, bringing up the rear is Dynair. <sighs> Dynair, Dynair, Dynair. He took a wrong turn. All right, let's go. Actually, let's talk to you. Go no further. Go no further. Good. I am glad you were courageous enough to pass me by. I did as I was bid. But I'll do no more than that. Your passage will displease my master, which pleases me greatly. Who is Fare this? well and lost Canaclim. Oh, I thought you'd finished. Uh, who is this master you speak of? Okay. In that case, I will search for your essence and wrest it from his control. Then you will be free. You'll have a hard time issuing commands with a crushed skull. Beware, half-elf. Your arrogance may be your undoing. Go now before your presence is discovered. My arrogance un... My arrogance, my undoing? I think not. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Why why did we get turned around now? That's kind of odd, but okay. Get back onto finding traps, right. please. Did that do a that did not do a, a quick save. Well, I mean, she found a trap. So, yay? Indeed. You must gather your party before venturing. I'm forth. a little bit Oh, well, hello. She may be a fool, but she's not stupid. She's beginning to suspect, I can tell. It's not stupidity that will lay her low, it's arrogance. She blinds herself to the truth. Wait, something's not right here. More than one thing, villain, but that will change soon enough. All hail Kalar, Lady of Light! Well, I must admit those are words I never thought I'd hear spoken in this place. Who are you? Hell's Claws, it's Elman Dredda. The ball spawn has found us out! Dragon, come to our defense! I am not compelled to honor your wishes. I was ordered to guard the door, nothing else. Defend yourselves, brothers! Well, shoot. All right, magic missile on you. You attack that one. You attack that one. And the three of us get in close. Why is this a dwarf? I have to defeat the Dark Magicians. Yeah. That's kind of how it works. Dang it. Gulp. Hmm. Minsk was immune to my damage. Oh, interesting. Oh, what now? Greater Malizon. Hmm. Let's see how long you last against me. We get so, there we go. There's a there's one kill. Now I'm tired. I swear the archers are the ones who uh, do this best. Vicony is held. Fantastic. we have. Is Vaconia charmed as well? Domination. Yep. Essentially. This was a good thing that she's held in. 
Okay, there's one. Not sure if that was in the area of effect or not, but... Ow! I'll recover. Ha! My aim is true! There we go. Ow! Alright, I'll, sp I'll try Breach. There we go. Now you're dead. What is going on with me? Ah, I'm asleep. Okay. And hopeless. I have a dispel magic? Let's try dispel magic on you. There we go. I'm still asleep, though. Fair enough. You have any uh, charges on that? You've got one. All right. Um. This group shows promise. Extraordinary. Not sure which ones. Well, you know what? Let's try. Can I quick save? I can. Can I sleep? Yeah, she was already asleep anyway. So whatever. Indeed. Okay, well, there's some uh, interesting items to pick up here. Alright, what can I automatically identify? Mage Robe of Electrical Resistance. Chuck that in there. Traveler's Robe. Chuck that in there. Darts of Wounding. Chuck that in there. Wand of Paralyzation. So yet another Wand of Paralyzation. I suppose I should actually use them. Dart of fire, dart plus one. It's clearly a wand of fire, of course. Quarter staff plus one. And braces of defense, armor class eight. Okay. So, wand of frost with three charges. And a wand of fire with two charges. Yeah, you go ahead and hold on to them for now. I need to try out the Wand of Fear more often. Let's go ahead and put this up there. Maybe you'll actually use it. Well... Eh, I don't know. Alright, well, we've rested. Certainly. You must we can go back in. Alright, Safana. Find Whatever traps. Like. Don't set them off. Uh, years of accumulated rust have transformed this door into a wall. It will not open for you or anyone else. Oh, come on. 19 strength. The sturdy, well crafted door resists all efforts to open it. There are doors up there that I cannot interact with. Any more traps? No? It's a tattered skeleton. Certainly. Victor, your companionship is not so grating as I feared. Uh, we've got a skeleton archer. Oh, man. <laughs> so she keeps canceling the uh, the turn on dead command, so I am yours to command. Actually, rather than magic missile, let's fireball. Ow! Don't Got a shattered no. soul. There we go.
Your orders? I think we killed it. That's good. Yes. Yes. Let's see. How These guys are doing a bit of damage to me. Uh. Don't don't lose a spell. Don't lose a spell. If that even worked. Ah, whatever. Why are you not doing anything? Attack this one. It has been a while since we fought these guys, and they seem to be maybe even more difficult than before. I don't know. Again. Oops. Didn't mean to close that out. Let's go ahead and heal you up. And heal you. You are out of spells. Alright, so one last cure light wounds. I am here. Alright, let's start grabbing the junk. That I can sell for a handful of coins each. Every little bit helps. All right. Uh, so yeah. Uh, again, I I don't like uh, turn undead in this game. It just indeed does not. Uh, I just find that it does not function Whatever well you at like. all. Great. Certainly. Try to find a trap, and what happens? Do I have a dispel magic? Can't change armor during combat, of course. Well, I did just quick save, so. You do not have a dispel magic. You uh you go wandering off that direction, get us get us all killed, why don't you? There we go. Your concern? <coughs> oh, sorry. It is done. Alright, come back here. I think it's time to just rest. Um Get my uh, robe back on. A den of stinking evil. Actually, this evil is not right. as smelly as it usually is. We come for you anyway. Well, scrubbed evil. It's still pretty stinky. Still pretty stinky. I think you might have a cold or something, uh, Minsk. No other uh, traps. What do we have here? Minor spell turning and conjure lesser air elemental. Keep watch for ancient tomes or any scrolls that might contain lost arcana. Yeah, we might actually find something like that. So conjure lesser air elemental is fifth level. That's kind of interesting. 
Uh, minor spell turning, fifth level also. Why am I putting them in there? I should be putting them in the scroll case. For now, at least. Right. Well, uh, we did find some Lost Arcana there, uh, Dynair. They're not exactly uh, ancient tomes, but they are scrolls. You want to find me any traps? There's got to be a trap on this bridge. Right? No? Alright, there's something I can interact with there. There's a Dark Magician and a Sacrifice there. And uh, I think we'll find out exactly what is going to happen with them in the next episode. Uh, since it is about time to end it, and... Um, I have a feeling that it's going to uh, lead to a battle of some sort. An un unearthly light glows from deep within the chasm. Voices echo throughout the ga gaping crevasse, pressing against the walls, seeking escape. Yep. See you next time, everyone.